Hi, this is Ms. McCormick, your creative expressions teacher. I'm going to walk you through how to draw this cupcake after we just listened to the story, Pete the Cat and the Missing Cupcakes. So we're going to draw a big cupcake sitting on a table. All you need is a piece of paper or your creative expressions and library sketchbook with a pencil. I'm going to go after each step. I am going to trace over it with a black marker so you can easily see what I am doing. But you do not have to do that until you color yours in. So I'm going to start with two circles, like little dots. And I'm going to bring this in a little bit here. And we're going to just round it. Then we're going to draw a line across. This is going to be the base or the bottom of your cupcake. And now I'm going to add the detail of the frosting. So we're going to go and we're rounding it off and cutting into it a little bit each time. We're going to do three, four or five layers here. And we're going up. So it's going to be a big fancy cupcake. So again, you want um, three to five things going up here. And then I'm going to draw a big circle here. That could be like a cherry or a sprinkle, um, whatever you want it to be, or uh, you know, possibly a piece of candy or a cookie. It's your piece of work. It's your imagination. So now I'm going to go back and add the detail. I'm going to do follow the shape of the line here and draw lines in. This is going to give it the detail for the wrapper. Now, I'm going to have it sit on a table, so I'm going to draw just a line, and then I'm going to go right to the edge, and then I'm going to pretend that I'm just going right through, and that's going to be the table that it's sitting on. So that is how to draw a cupcake inspired by Pete the Cat and the Missing Cupcakes.